You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I'm back. Road Trance for our Black and White Sports 2. Well, as we know, many Democratic leaders like Gretchen Whitmer in Michigan, they're in a bit of a panic right now. And of course, what do Democrats do? They run out. They try to find celebrity endorsements. And Gretchen Whitmer, my God, no other governor outside of maybe Oregon, California, no other governor hurt their state more during the COVID fiasco than one Gretchen Whitmer. Of course, she was out sauntering around and doing whatever the hell she wanted while um, slapping her residents with all kinds of COVID restrictions funny we saw that a lot well voters have not forgotten that of course everybody expects a red wave or red tsunami make sure i've already gotten out and voted today red all the way down texas greg abbott declare a full-blown invasion here let's stop what's going on at the border um as best you can i know that he's gotta go up against beijing biden so uh uh, Gretchen is concerned because Tudor Dixon is up there. She got a Trump endorsement and she's really playing a couple of different angles, crime and parents, things involving parents, uh, what's happened to school kids, either with the restrictions and the drop in scores. That's repugnant businesses that Gretchen Whitmer, uh, hurt. And frankly, Michigan is up for grabs. And so what happens here? Well, calling a celebrity. Calling a celebrity. Luckily, most common sense Americans don't give a rip what celebrity endorses who. We just saw uh, LBJ, LeBron James. He decided to endorse radical Democrat Raphael Warnock. Well, Magic Johnson has decided to jump in and, and uh, throw his support behind radical leftist socialist Governor Gretchen Whitmer. Of course, he went to Michigan State University. This is OutKick. Oh, the Democrats are concerned. The Dems are so frightened by the thought of a red tsunami that they're calling up personalities deep on the celebrity bench to endorse their candidates. One of the reserves is L.A. Lakers legend Irving Magic Johnson. He tweeted his, res- his support for Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer on Monday on the eve of a high-stakes fight for Michigan's governor's seat between Whitmer and Republican challenger Tudor Dixon. I like Tudor a lot. Quote, I hope that Governor Gretchen Whitmer gets another four years as governor of Michigan. He might as well have tweeted, I hope Michigan gets run straight into the shitter. That's just, he should have just come out and tweeted that. He joined the rush of celebrity endorsements pouring out as Democrats inch closer to a dismal fate on Tuesday. I do not want that taken for granted. Go out, vote red. Magic's gonna have to pull a rabbit out of his hat or ass and tens of thousands of fake ballots to put Whitmer back on the governor's seat. Quote, tell me you don't live in Michigan without saying you don't live in Michigan. One Twitter user responded. Yeah, I tried to figure that out too. I was like, um, aren't you in L.A.? Aren't you in L.A. right now? Quote, I've been waiting for another billionaire to tell me how to go vote. I'm not even a Michigan Michigan Nander and still feel better knowing she's in charge. One tweeter joked. The 63-year-old Johnson was scheduled to appear at Whitmer's rally in East Lansing Monday night. He last appeared on the political stage in 2020 during then-candidate Joe Biden's presidential campaign trail. Whitmer has been grilled for her poor job as governor. There's Clay Travis. After being caught breaking her own absurd rule on a number of people allowed at a restaurant table, Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer ended the rule today. How about ending all COVID restrictions in Michigan, Governor? They're nonsensical. And my God, that was just May 24, 2021. My God, that's crazy. Facing several issues that have gone unanswered by Whitmer, such as draconian COVID lockdowns, skyrocketing crime rates. We know Democrats don't give a rip about crime. 
and enforcement of progressive gender ideology. And that's the one that's going to end up getting her elected out. She's going to end up getting the boot over that. You're pushing gender ideology in the schools and on kids and parents are pissed. Referring to women as persons with a period. What the hell? The Michigan voters' wrath is well on its way to oust their inept governor. Violent crime offenses in Michigan jumped 12.4% in 2020 compared to 56 nationwide. Quote, we're done with Whitner's violent crime wave in the state of Michigan. GOP challenger Dixon said at a rally with former President Donald Trump, as relayed by Bridgemy.com, we will protect every community. I mean, really? People with a period. Okay. There's a face in that crowd you might recognize. Yes, it's Michigan Governor at Gre- uh, Gretchen Whitmer. And that is, yeah, that's her right there. And that's at a restaurant viol- violating her own COVID restrictions. There you go. I mean, look, everybody needs a celebrity or a sports star to tell them how to vote, right? I don't know a single person that gives a literal rip who Magic Johnson wants you to vote for. In fact, uh, Magic Johnson endorsed, well, cross that person off the list. I mean, that's just where I've gotten. At this point, I would vote against most celebrities out of pure, unadulterated spite. Their heads are so far up their asses and in the clouds, they've got no connection to you or me as everyday common sense Americans. None. They don't give a F about you. They've got private security. They're not worried about crime. They came and went as they pleased during COVID. Make no mistake. Americans don't care. Sorry, Magic Johnson. Again, aren't you in LA right now? Why are you endorsing somebody in Michigan? Does anybody give a F? I'm trying to I'm I'm trying to figure this out. Why would somebody that's in California have influence over somebody over in Michigan? Not only that, but look at LA and look at California. It's a dumpster fire rolling downhill on a tire fire. Christ. Tell me what you think, black and white sports two fans. Magic Johnson make you want to run out and uh, vote for Gretchen Whitmer? She looks evil, doesn't she? Peace. I'm out. Till next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.